Hey, what do you know? It's time for a 1030 S build. Me, Scott. Not Paps, Scott. I got one guy calling me Paps in the comments. It says short for Pops. I don't know. We got this bar on last time. We got it drilled. Actually got the windshield cut. Got my first block glued in the fastening block. And I'm ready to uh, fasten it down. It's a hot one here in Southeast Virginia. Still, the guys give us a really nice day. Really blessing us good, as usual. All right. I got some uh, fat stainless steel screws that I'm going to use for this. That is. Of it right here. And now I need to uh, drill a hole into this mounting block I put right here. Put a screw right there. And what I'm going to do is rivet, rivet the uh, windshield to the aluminum bar with these 5 30 second rivets but I'm not going to do it now because I'm going to take all that back off you know to cover the skin on that I'm going to get this screw in here up sanding here and there and of course some final adjustment of all the cables still have to put on the uh, flapper on collector right here still got to put on a little little piece that goes right here that holds this bar up here in three different positions for the flapper on and you just this adjust the uh, angle of your airline cable right there and I got the fire extinguisher mounted the throttle mounted the Trim mounted, rudders, everything's in. Got the uh, seatbelt cables ready to go, just got to hook into them. Everything, of course, is just on with temporary nuts and bolts. Nothing's tightened down really yet. But uh, she, she's looking good. The engine on, but when she. Window on and the windshield and all that started to look like an airplane. So now I gotta clean this workbench off, level it up best I can, sand it, smooth it, 
a little weed eater I got to fix up there too. We're going to uh, start on the wings. I got most of the ribs ready to go. The ribs that actually hold the airline, I have to uh, put on these pieces, you know, the hinges and the nosings for the um, airlines and um, ends of the airlines. Bunch, bunch of stuff to do for that. Hopefully, the next two or three months, we'll get this thing in the air. Of course, the iPad mounts right there. It's all coming together pretty good. I don't know about y'all, but my life has got so many challenges right now. You know, I still got that guy who owed me money for the first engine. We want to court on that pretty soon. And um, y'all pray for me that um, the thief pays me what he owes me. I pray that uh, he'll be okay too. I hope whatever it is messing him up will we'll get straight and uh, God will forgive him for being a thief and stealing from people. And, um, hope his life can move on and he can get over all these other problems he got with his uh, engines malfunctioning and, and all the problems he's having with that. But uh, you know, there's all kinds of challenges we face every day. The engine, the temperature, the weather, our work, our family. And I just pray and hope you pray with me that God will look out for us and do the best we can. We'll learn and live together a little bit better. Hope to see you next time. Take care. Remember to look up.